What's up guys, Amy here. Now, since I made my latest video on connecting your custom domain to Groove, which was posted around the 16th of June, 2021, a few people reached out to me in regards to troubleshooting their custom domains. So in this video, I'm gonna give you two fixes for connecting and publishing your domains on Groove. And before we dive into solutions, I would really appreciate it if you guys could hit on that like button to support the channel because it does take time to create videos like this to help you out. Are you ready? Let's go. Okay guys, it's going to be a really short video. Problem number one, you followed the steps in my latest tutorial, but your domain is not appearing under published in Groove pages. For example, a subscriber reached out to me and sent me a screen share mentioning that when he clicked on the publish button in Groove pages, he selected custom domain, but got a notice of please select your free Groove pages subdomain or add your main domain before setting up hosting. And he also got a green tick with a status of secure and connected with Groove pages icon activated with a blue color and a red underline stating that Groove pages is the hero app. Here's the solution. You need to set your subdomain on Groove Pages first for a brand new Groove account, even if you connected your custom domain. This acts like a fallback just in case you don't want to use your custom domain and you want to use Groove Pages subdomain. So you will head to your avatar here, click on My Accounts, Domains, and click on Groove Pages subdomain, then click on Manage and give your subdomain on Groove Pages a name. So I'm just gonna call this Amy Vo and click on save. Okay, it's updated, click on update. And just to make sure I would log out, right click, inspect, head up here, hold down and empty cache and hard reload and log back in. Head back to your Groove Pages project under publish. You will now see hosting options available and then you can select custom domains, domain, I'll just select boss funnels and for the location, it'll be root domain. Then I'll hit publish, which is the cloud icon. And then you're done. Give that a go and tell me if it works. Problem number two, you have a Groove Pages website or funnel on the root domain, i.e. bossfunnels.co is on the root domain. But now you want to create a funnel on the subdomain, i.e. I want lp.bossfunnels.co as a subdomain and I also want it on Groove Pages. Here's the solution. You need to have one Groove Pages project for your root domain and create another Groove Pages project for your subdomain that you uses the same root domain. And some people have wiped out their existing design on Groove Pages by doing this. They go to domains and select the root domain, but for location, they select subdomain and they click on add new domain and then hit publish. What they've done here is that they've converted the root domain into a subdomain. And for your subdomain, you can either create a new site in group pages or you can clone your existing funnel if you like the design of it. So what I've done is I've cloned it and now I just wanna open the clone group pages. Under publish, go to custom domain, domains, select boss funnels. Under location, it'll be a subdomain. And for subdomain, I wanna click on add new subdomain and you can give your subdomain a name here. I've entered LP, but you need more than three characters. So let's just give these funnels, click add a subdomain, and you probably need to wait around five minutes for it to go live. Once it goes live, hover over here, click on this. Over in the browser, you can see my subdomain is added. All right, guys, I hope that video helped. If it did, hit that like button for me, subscribe to the channel if you haven't already done so, and until next time, see ya.